scary facts you didn't know about. If you sleep late at night, there's a high chance this might happen to you. People who sleep late at night have a higher chance of seeing spirits and having them around you. Deep facts you didn't know about. That mood where everything irritates you indicates that you're actually missing someone. Crying is how your body speaks when your mouth can't explain the pain you feel. Gruesome Facts You Didn't Know, Part 56. Charles II of Spain is the result of nearly 200 years of inbreeding meant to maintain the royal bloodline. He was completely illiterate, had difficulty eating, and could barely speak. Their family was also quite known for their protruding bottom jaw, known as the Hadsburg Jaw. This photo from the 1870s is a massive pile of bison skulls to be ground up into fertilizer. In 2013, two vintage cars were pulled from Foss Lake, Oklahoma, containing six skeletons. The remains that were found belonged to people who disappeared in the 60s and 70s. All six died from drowning and their deaths were ruled as accidental. Here are a few grisly facts about the Victorian era. They would often keep their deceased at home for the mourning period, posing them in family photos as if they were still alive. Hysterectomies were used to treat mental illness. Corpse medicine was very much still a thing. One popular remedy was human skull mixed with chocolate. Divorce wasn't a thing, so men would sell their unwanted wives. The dumbest deaths ever. King Charles II of Navarre, born in 1332, died in 1387. When he fell sick, his doctors ordered him to be wrapped in linen and covered in brandy. When it came time to remove the linens, his nurse decided it would be best to burn off the last thread rather than cut it, essentially grilling him alive in his own palace. There are killers on the loose, traveling from town to town, state to state, stalking their victims, kidnapping, raping, then murdering them. What would you do if you got out of here? I would probably do the same thing all over again. What would you do? Try to murder everyone on the planet Earth. Joseph Kellinger, a brutal serial killer. We'll be seeing more of him tonight, too. On average, each day, five innocent people fall victim to homicidal monsters, like John Wayne Gacy, who was convicted of more murders than anyone else. Authorities have identified 120 serial sex killers. According to some estimates, 35 of them are still on the loose. They roam the highways and shopping centers of America, crazed with sadistic lust. Police insist that to avoid becoming one of their victims, the public must first understand the perverse kind of twisted minds that they are up against. So meet Joe Callinger, currently serving a life sentence for sex-related murder here at the State Hospital for the Criminally Insane, just outside Scranton, Pennsylvania. I'm a patient person, got a good listening ear, and try to help people. You're a patient with a good ear, and you try to help people? Yes. When you're not trying to murder them? Yes. When Callinger's reign of terror ended, three were dead, including his 14-year-old son. You murdered your own son? Yes, I did. Why did you do that? He was a sacrifice. I was to murder three million people on planet Earth, and he was a sacrifice to see if I could murder one of my own. At the end of murdering all the people on Earth, I was going to murder my own family and then take my own life and become God. What do you think of the death penalty? I'm opposed to it. The state has no right to take your life, but you can murder other people? I don't think anyone has a right to take a life. Except you? When I'm under hallucination, I do. These voices from God, these hallucinations, do you still experience them? Yes, I do. Often? Often. Do you ever feel violent? Yes, I do. What do you feel like doing? Killing people. You still feel like killing people? Yes. Describe the feeling that you get when you feel like killing people. Well, last March 11th, I was hallucinating, and I took a razor blade and I cut a man's throat. Here in the hospital? Here in the hospital. Do you think you'd murder me, Joe? Yes. That's gruesome, Joe. That's horrible. Yes, it is. And you don't blame me if I say I hope you never get out of this place. I hope I never do either. Amen. Oh, brr, 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 brr. Yo, what's up? Here's some scary facts about our world that you probably didn't want to know. Part 20.
Before Michael Jackson actually passed away, five hours before he died, someone posted the exact way and time he would die. And it was 100% accurate, and it did happen that exact way. Facebook actually shut down two robots that they created known as Alice and Bob because they started talking to each other in their own language. Yeah, I probably would have shut them down too. The CIA once came out with a weapon that kind of mimicked the behavior of a taser, but instead of sending electricity through the body, it gave the same symptoms and reactions as a heart attack would, and it was known as the heart attack gun. Halloween actually started out with people using real animal heads and skin as their Halloween costumes, and so that they could fit in with other spirits to make sure the spirits thought that they were actually spirits so that they could pass and roam. 2008, a boy named James was gifted with an Elmo doll, and as soon as they put the batteries in the Elmo doll, the dog exclaimed, kill James. Yeah, I don't know where they bought that doll. Scary facts to give you chills. There's a 50% chance someone is stalking you when you are on a walk. There could be spider eggs inside of you right now and you wouldn't have any idea. If you don't like, share and follow, this will find you tonight. Don't risk it. Scary facts that will give you chills. A man survived in a sunken ship for nearly three days to 170 feet underwater. In a year you can swallow up to 14 insects when you sleep. Lack of sleep can cause the brain to start eating itself.